We go now to WFMY News 2's Giselle Thomas, who spoke with some of the people who watched and paid their respects as the procession moved along. Now, Friendly Avenue is usually a very busy street, and today, during Sergeant Nix's processional, it fell silent to make way for one of Greensboro's hometown heroes. Sergeant Philip Dale Nix, a man of service, honor and dedication to the city of Greensboro. Some residents came out to see the procession to pay respects with heavy hearts. It's just hard for all, every agency right now. It's hard for the fire department, police, especially Greensboro Fire Department due to his family being with the fire department. It's, and As a volunteer firefighter, Burroughs says living a life of service comes with true dedication. Burroughs says Sergeant Nix was a role model for him. When I found out that it was one of our officers, one of Greensboro police officers, it broke me. I just didn't know what to say. I'm friends with so a lot of Greensboro police officers and friends with law enforcement all over the state. It's just, it hurts. To many, Sergeant Nix is a hero. He served the city of Greensboro for more than two decades. He was uh, one of the best of the best, and he was just doing what he would do on any day that he was on duty. He happened to be off duty, but he's a brave hero that has served this community for many, many years. We pray for you every day, every minute of every day in the last couple of weeks. We pray for our first responders. We pray for our active military. And, and our veterans for their safe return so they can get home every night. Now, many of the people I met today said that they had to come to pay their respects whether they knew Sergeant Nix or not. And that speaks volumes for the tight-knit community that we have here in Greensboro. Giselle Thomas, WFMY News 2.